Hi everybody, it's Tammy and I am back to share with you my Spellbinders haul. Now, Spellbinders had a big huge sale and I saw this posted also on Instagram. I th it might have been um, Ebony who was sharing more on YouTube and also on Instagram. It might have been her or maybe it was somebody else that had posted it or either it was Spellbinders, I don't remember. But they were saying they were having a sale and I was like, oh, let me go check it out. Um, at this point, I hadn't done any online ordering. Um, I had maybe just started working from home. Um, I don't know, but I went and there was so much. Oh my goodness, there were so many things that I wanted. And I will show you my all-time favorite purchase from this sale is this. It is the Journey, the um, Fun Stampers Journey uh, Rolling Tote. And I love it. It's huge, so I can't really show it to you. But um, it was only $30. And that, to me, was a steal. It's a coated fabric that has, like, a clear coat on it. And I have a craft bag you know a rolling craft bag that has the extending handle but it's on the smaller side and also there's nothing on it that I can use to pick it up to put it into my car I've always like hated that about it so I always have to grip it from the sides right here and that's where the zippers are so every time I pick it up and you know it's full of stuff so it's kind of heavy I always worry about ripping and and destroying those zippers so then when I saw this and it was only $30 and it has two handles or a handle on each side to actually pick it up that way. And it also has the telescoping handle and then these awesome wheels. So 30 bucks. I was like, yes and yes. <laughs> and then they also had this, which they call this the Fun Stampers Journey Business Tote. This was only $15. So I picked that up too to go with my um, my rolling tote. It has a little back little piece right here that you put over the telescoping handle on the rolling tote. And um, it has lots of pockets. Lots and lots of pockets. Again, it's hard to show you because it's kind of on the... It's not too huge, but... And then inside here there are pockets for, um, you know, tools and stuff like that. And then there is two pockets right here and here to put things in. And then I also got this piece. And this is called the, um, I think it's a tool caddy. I put the, uh, oh, it's just called Totally Tool. So it's like a little tool pouch that has pockets, zippered pockets, pieces where you can like put scissors and stuff like that and then there's another zipper pocket here and then that folds and it can fit into your tote or into the business bag and that was only five bucks so for fifty dollars I got a rolling tote a bag and then also a tool pouch for crafting whenever it is that you know we get to go <laughs> whenever the next time I'm able to go out and go on a crop or something like that I am set <laughs> but that was a really good deal I, I had been kind of hoping that I would find one of the um, Hobby Lobby bags when they do their clearances I was always hoping that I would find um, one of their bags on clearance but I never did I was never able to find them they would always sell them out really quickly so here's how the bag and this is just a picture online the big the the rolling tote and the other bag fit together so really awesome and I love the color the color is so pretty so that was the first part of my haul so I was like oh wow I was so excited about that and then um, then I saw these and I was like oh my goodness so these are the card kits of the month these are normally $55 I believe and they had them for $15. So I had to do some serious talking to myself. <laughs> I, had to, I had to talk myself off the cliff for a little bit. But I ended up getting four different ones. 
um there were so many that i wanted i ended up only getting four um but yeah i was so happy with these so i got the golden swan which was a Feb february i don't know what year february card kit of the month the night out card kit of the month um super chill and you can see these are some older ones from 2019 but i mean i didn't really care this one is the celebrate and that was for july 2019 so i did open up the um golden swan one and i'll just show you what's inside really quickly um so it's stock full of, of goodies so there's a paper here that's showing you what's inside so there's 10 cards and envelopes a set of 10 dies a paper pad a stamp set sequins eight pieces of cardstock 10 die cut shapes assorted stickers tag tags foam squares and adhesive tape so this is february 2019 so these are all older kits from last year but again like i said it did not bother me at all so this is the stamp set. I love the mason jar. And then there's a bunch of different flowers you can stamp and put, you know, stamp into the jar. And then there's some sentiments there as well. Here's the die set, which is this beautiful swan. It's a layered swan. And then also some floral pieces. So I'm guessing it makes up all of that. Really, really cute. And then here are the die cut pieces. And they're foiled and there's a ton of them in there here are the cards and envelopes the sequins <laughs> and then here's the the adhesive and foam squares and stickers love love these look like Maggie Holmes but I don't think they are um, but um, puffy stickers and then these are layered stickers with some glitter on them or uh, yeah some glitter and then these are foil stickers and then here's the paper pad which I love so this is a golden swan paper pad and it is six by six it doesn't say how many pages are in it but it's super pretty I love this one right here so look at that oh my goodness all the foiling that's really beautiful look at the swan right here oh my goodness so pretty i love this and that's foiled and then they repeat so that's awesome and then here's all the cardstock so these are solid pieces of cardstock and um and then there's a piece of double-sided foiled paper which is really thick so that's awesome that's a nice nice kit and just really really beautiful so that is what I got. Um, so that's one of the kits that I got. So I'm not going to open them all up because I've only actually opened this one. I don't know what's, I mean, I remember from when I ordered it, but um, I haven't opened them since I got the order. And then I got two steel ruled dies. The first one was this beautiful contour flower. So it's called Layered Blooms. And you can see here on the photo, they punched it out of. Um, felt so I want to make some felt flowers and this is uh, I don't know if you can see the well yeah you can the die the pieces so they're a nice size so I picked up that and then this one I didn't realize it was so big but I have a die cut machine that it will fit in and this one is the um, type O die so this is another alphabet die set and the letters are not a really big size about mm, two inches an inch and a half two inches um very nice size it includes letters and numbers and that's really cool so i picked up that one too and i don't think my um packing list doesn't have the price but i don't even think it was that expensive so i picked up that I know this was only a dollar, so I got two of them. So this is the Journey Blooms keychain. So there's three rolled roses, and there's like a logo charm, and then the keychain pieces. So again, I got two of those. Um, and then they had um, 
the tinsel. So I got a pack of the silver tinsel. And then they also have the gold tinsel. And there's just four yards on here, but that's enough. I didn't have gold, but I had silver, but that's, um, you know, they're only a dollar. And then they had a lot of the um, a Gilded Life items for a dollar. So I picked up a few of these. These are the beaded rosary chain. Um, but I just use it for the chain to make dangles and things like that. But they have, and they're, these are glass beads. So there's glass pearls and then these really pretty pink crystals. And then here's one um, that has two different sizes of uh, clear beads. So it has this size and then that larger size. And I think I got two of each of those. I know I got two of the pink one because I love the pearls. Yeah, so I got two packs of each. And again, these were a dollar each as well. And then I got some of the, um, here's the other keychain. Some of the Gilded Life metal pieces, which I have a collection of these. I need to start using them, but I don't think I had these. So I got this one, and then there's a larger one of that same size. And then I got two of this one. And I think these were like a dollar or two dollars, but they were so inexpensive. And this before I think was like $8.99 or something like that just because of the size. So there's a glass plate right here. A piece of glass. So I like using these for like little shadow boxes or either fill them with pearls and stuff like that. And and then this you'd have to, um, you would glue that down. I think they, they glued it down with um, glossy accents. And then they glue on the metal piece on top using E6000 but love it and then there's a loop so then you can use that as a um as a pendant or on a you know on something else so then there were dyes so of course i had to look at the dyes and get some dyes okay so these are all the dyes that i got sorry for the glare oh this is a <laughs> this is the cutest little charm it's a credit card and that was only a dollar too so i picked that up I got this destination um, spellbinder die. So this is the the thin the thin metal die. So I love it. It's um, a street lamp with a sign. So 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 cute. I got that one. I got this basic rectangles. So there's three small rectangles. Then I got this one, which is the foliage flourish. Really really pretty. And there's three dies in there. Then I got this classic squares small. And there's seven dies in there. And I love this shape. So I love how it looks layered. So this was the belly band one. Or belly band one. So, um. Oh, okay, I see. So there are, it cuts. And it leaves like a, um. A slit on the side for you to, to slide this over a strip of paper so it's actually you can actually depending on how you glue it you can probably move this whole piece around on the belly band which is kind of cool so that's five pieces and then this one is called charming tag set Ch charming tag pocket so here's the tag and then there's inserts on the tag this is the pocket right here with that cute scallop top and then it says Mary, but you don't have to use that. You can use some of these instead. And then there's a cute little stocking. So there's seven dies on that one. Really pretty. And then this one I thought was so cute. It's pockets and swirls. So there's eight dies in this one. But I got it mainly for the pockets. To use them as pockets in, um, you know, um, junk journals and stuff like that. But it came with all these other pieces too. So that's really cool. And then I got this tagged pocket, um, which I thought was really cool. So I love the scalloped top. And then it just has one large scallop at the bottom where you fold up. So again, I got that. And this is a pretty, I think this is a, yeah, this is a nice size. It's a nice size die. So that'll make a nice big pocket. 
And then I got this one of a kind Spellbinder stamp and die set. Love the feather and then the sentiment here and then it has dies that punches them out. Um, so these are uh, Fun Stampers Journey Journey Pockets. So these are keep, keepsake envelopes assorted packs. And I got two of these and I, I know they were really, really inexpensive. And I was kind of curious to find out exactly what they were. But they're sticky back little pockets in different sizes that you can put on a project and then fold it down and glue it down um, really cool so there are 10 in each pack so I got two packs of those and then I got this uh, graceful tiny tags love the shapes of these tags and then there's sentiments that go in I love the handmade by and then this one is um, floral divine again really pretty florals and the dies to go with it and then this cute little um, stickers my battery is dying but I am done so that is my spellbinder haul thank you for watching and I hope you're all having a really great day bye